In the Clone Wars, a raid on an ancient temple to recover a lost Sith gauntlet was led by Jedi Master Bink Utrilla, followed by her Padawan and a squad of clone troopers. Upon entering, a clone named Glitch stepped on a pressure play that activated a massive droid guardian. After blasters and thermal detonators didn't seem to affect the robot, Glitch stretched out his hand trying to use the force. While the other clones teased him, the Jedi actually got the idea to deactivate the droid using their abilities. Afterwards, they passed through a lightsaber activated door that opened by inserting the saber in a slot only a Jedi could sense was correct. Pushing on, Glitch secretly listened to the Jedi to learn more about the force. After finally reaching the gauntlet, the group left the building when the darkness surrounding it terrified Master Utrilla. That night, the group was set on by the Death Watch who nearly killed them before Glitch attacked their leader with one of the Jedi's lost lightsabers. The clone landed several blows on Vizsla but was pushed back into the temple where he intentionally activated the wrong door slot, bringing the entire structure down and sacrificing himself. Unknown to his friends, Glitch survived, using the powers of the ancient gauntlet then casting it into a river, finally realizing the force flows through everything.